Hi, everybody. Now, a burning question that I've been getting from several of you in the comments is, what exactly is a trigonometric function anyway? I've got that question right here. We're going to answer that. A trigonometric function is one of six functions. Um, they are sine, cosine, tangent, and uh, then I'm going to write over here on the side cosecant, and secant and cotangent. These are abbreviations for each of those. And by the way, that little circle that I'm drawing with a line through it, that is called a theta. This is theta. And that is just a variable that we use for angles a lot. Uh, it's just like an X or Y, but it's just it's a Greek letter and we use it when we deal with angles uh, oftentimes. Um, so these six trig functions refer to a triangle a right triangle, and uh, they can actually be used on things that aren't right triangles, but um, we start out with a right triangle. You can put the theta up here, down here. It doesn't matter. I'm going to choose to put it right there. Um, so when you have a theta right here, this side across from it is called the opposite side. And then down below, this is the adjacent side. Adjacent means next to, so this is touching that angle. It's adjacent. And then the long side is always called the hypotenuse. And so sine, cosine, and tangent is just a, a ratio of those sides. Sine is opposite over hypotenuse. Cosine is adjacent over hypotenuse. So this side over this. And we'll do some examples in a minute. Tangent is uh, opposite over adjacent. And now these three, cosecant, secant, and cotangent, are just sine flipped, cosine flipped, tangent flipped, or you could say the reciprocal. Uh, cosecant, instead of opposite over hypotenuse, it is hypotenuse over opposite. Secant is not adjacent over hypotenuse, it's hypotenuse over adjacent. And then finally, tangent is not opposite over adjacent. Uh, cotangent is adjacent over opposite. Um, so, suppose we have a right triangle over here. This time I'll make the theta maybe up top here. And uh, we'll uh, say this is like 3, this is 4, and this is 5. And so if you want to take the sine of theta now, that's going to be opposite over hypotenuse. That's 3 fifths. Cosine would be adjacent over hypotenuse, that's 4 over 5. Tangent would be opposite, this one, over adjacent, 3 over 4. Cosecant is um, the reciprocal of 3 fifths, that's 5 over 3, and you know that because 3 fifths, I'm sorry, 5 thirds is hypotenuse over opposite, it's Hypotenuse right here over opposite. Secant is hypotenuse over adjacent, or the flip of cosine, 5 over 4. And cotangent is the reciprocal of tangent. It's going to be 4 over 3, or you could say adjacent over opposite. That's adjacent over opposite. So that's just the basics of what the six trigonometric functions are and how you find them from a right triangle. I hope this helped. Uh, again, keep your comments coming. I love to hear from my viewers and know exactly what they want to hear from this channel and what they want to see in this space. Uh, you guys have a great day, and uh, I'll see you soon.